the strong tower. Yes. The righteous run to it and are. Uh, so do you know that you are safe? Anybody safe in this place? Hallelujah. Hallelujah.
for this atmosphere, Lord Jesus, that you have planted, Lord Jesus, for us, Lord Jesus, with your blood, Lord Jesus, with your mercy, Lord Jesus, with your kindness towards us, Lord Jesus, for we are nothing, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. We abase ourselves, we humble ourselves right now, Lord on, Jesus. Jesus. We become dust, prayer. Lord Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, hallelujah, Jesus. We put on sackcloth and ashes, Lord come Jesus, on, on. hallelujah. We look at ourselves, Lord Jesus, in the level of our Lord Jesus, hallelujah, Jesus. And we see that we are filthy rags in your presence, Lord Jesus. So we ask you, Lord Jesus, right now, Lord Jesus, to receive our spirit, our broken spirit, Lord Jesus. Our contract hard, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. Soften us up, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. We are broken, Lord Jesus, in your presence, Lord Jesus. We ask you to seal us, Lord Jesus, with your blood, Lord Jesus. Seal the four folks in the natural, Lord Jesus, hallelujah, Jesus. Let, Lord Jesus, everything that is not of you pass over, Lord Jesus, so that you can come and find rest in us, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Fill us up, Lord Jesus, from the crown of our head to the sole of our feet, Lord Jesus. Let, Lord Jesus, that ladder, Lord Jesus, that Jacob seed, let it ascend, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. We call this house, Lord Jesus, better, Lord Jesus, the house of God, Lord Jesus, a fearful and a dreadful place, Lord Jesus. We call forth, Lord Jesus, the angels to descend, Lord Jesus, and ascend, Lord Jesus, in our very presence right now, Lord Jesus. Transform and transcend this atmosphere, Lord Jesus. Let's on our own, Lord Jesus, on each and every one of us right now, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. As we look to you, Lord Jesus, as the altar and our sinister, Lord Jesus, of our faith, Lord Jesus. Everything, Lord Jesus, before this world has been formed, Lord Jesus, has already been called of, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. You already spoken into existence, Lord Jesus. Let us see it as it is, Lord Jesus. So we can speak into existence, Lord Jesus. Let your glory manifest, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. In our blood, Lord Jesus. In our bodies, Lord Jesus. In our bodies, Lord Jesus. In our Lord Jesus. In our bodies, 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 Lord Jesus
are not lost. But I've been searching. I've been searching. The waters are troubled. Only because I'm taking you through. Because when you come out of this, said the Lord, you will burn out a new anointing. There will be a new glory on the inside of you. Right now, you don't know what's going on. But it is my hand. I'm shaking it. I'm shaking. I'm shaking things in my children's life. I'm causing you to seek me, to draw nigh unto me, to seek my face day and night. Some of you have drew back. You went after what you thought was me. But in this hour, I will visit you. I will visit about my visitation. Some of you have been pregnant for too long and you have not pushed through. I hear you crying before the Lord saying, Lord, when? When is it going to change? When is it going to shift? When is it going to turn? But I hear the Lord saying, if you get in my presence, if you call upon me, if you endure through the storm, the storm will take away those things that have interfered with our relationship. But I'm going to water you, I'm going to sacrifice it. I'm going to water you like I watered the plants. I'm going to cause you to grow in this hour, Sheba. And your fruit shall be ripe. I bring my children to repentance. And I cause them to ask for forgiveness. They may not know the thing that they have done. But I shall show you in your character. I shall show you in your thinking. I will speak to you clearly. And when you hear my voice, hold back your heart. Because I am in the midst. And I come to do right by you. I come to rebuke the enemy. And I come to break you forth. That thing that you've been holding is Let it go. Let it go. You know who you are, You know what it is. You've been holding it for a while, And I, the Lord, come unto you tonight to speak into your ear and to speak to your heart and tell you to let it go. Release that thing that's been holding you back. Forgive the one who did it. Release them and forgive their debt because I have forgiven you. Let it go, Shabbat Come out of the broken place and come into the place of wholeness. Come into the place where your tears are glad. Come into the place where your heart rejoices. Come into the place where I can fellowship and I can speak to you face to face. Come into the place where I can share my heart with you. Come to the place where I can reveal who I am. You only have a portion, but there is much more. I'm going to show you the things that you have forgotten and those things that you have yet to learn. I'm going to speak to you clearly and you will know exactly what to do. For you are wealthy because you have the creator upon your life. And I will never turn. I will never repeat. And I will never look back. But I see your future And what I have done It shall come to pass What I have spoken It shall come to pass And those things that I have revealed Even in your dreams I call you blessed I call you sanctified I call you holy I call you wise And I shall reveal myself In the abundance of my 
Because you have relationship, because you have relationship, enter into the quarters, lay with me, worship me, and watch me change your heart. There are some conditions that I look upon and I see, and you're wondering how you're going to get rid of it. You say, I don't want to be the same, but the Lord says, I make the change, I am your difference. And you fall in love with me. You come to me. And I'll make all things new, said the Lord. worship him, tell him you love him tell him you adore him tell him it's all about him tell him you're willing to give up yourself, you're willing to surrender right now come on, you can't do it alone you believe in him but sometimes you feel by yourself but the Lord said I'm right there and I'm speaking to you I even move upon your heart at times and you're wondering what it is that have touched you the Lord said my hand has touched you. I called you out and I pointed you out. Ah, oh, many don't understand you. But keep my appointment. Keep my appointment. And I will show you more. I will reveal myself even greater. And you will be able to declare until the children, until the earth, that thing that God has done, that thing that I have done, I have revealed. I am your revelation. I Revelation. I am your revelation. I will make this. Pour out upon him. We all need him. I hear the call of God coming from far. I hear him bidding his bride to come. I, I see him bidding the bride to come. I see him calling her from afar. I see her adorned. I see her gone beyond the earth's atmosphere into the space, into the celestial. And the Lord is calling. He said, come unto me. But there are so many, hallelujah, that he's called bride, but they forgot who they were. And the Lord said that I'm calling you back into this intimate place to lay with me, to, to, to minister to me, to know my heart. And I'm going to do things with you in this hour that men have not seen. Because of your faith, woman, and because of your faith, man, I'm going to rise within you. I'm going to rise upon you. And when they look upon you, you shall look different. Your voice shall sound different. Your praise shall sound different. Your worship shall sound different because I will put my voice in you. I will put my spirit in you. A new portion. A new dispensation. And a new release. This is your hour of visitation. It is your hour of visitation. Be married. Be engaged. And love on the Lord with all your heart. Trust Him. And lead back to your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him. And He will direct your path. Hallelujah. Glory. Thank you. 